It's game day for the women's soccer team. With kickoff in a couple hours, the Lions take this time to mentally prepare themselves for the challenge ahead. When it comes to game time, I think it's pretty much the same. Like, we're about to go on the field, play a game, whether it be home or away. So, like, really focus on, like, who we're playing and just focus on what I need to do personally for my team so we can, you know, hopefully come out with a win. After fueling their bodies, finishing up homework, and taking power naps, the team loads up the bus in game mode. It's no longer just about having fun. The work starts here. The team meets in the locker room to pump up for game time. This means singing, dancing, and relying on junior forward Serena Bolden to get them into game mode. girls like like if I like even say like no I'm not really feeling it today like I don't want to do it like that there's no no you're gonna do it like <laughs> I think that's really special that a lot of the girls really like want that for me and so I want to give it to them The team heads to the field to warm up. After running some drills, they change into their uniforms and line up for the pregame. Hand in hand, these women are ready for the whistle to blow and yet another opportunity to play with their best friends. The game starts out strong, with LMU controlling the ball. The Gauchos show up with a tough defense that makes it hard for the Lions to finish. Having lost to USC two days earlier, the pressure to win is palpable. A change from my freshman year, like I would sometimes let that get in my head and it would affect my play, but I think as the years have gone on, um, I've learned to like tune out distractions and like other noises and just focus on my game. The match is still tied at 0-0 heading towards halftime. With subs floating in and out of the game, the Lions can't seem to put a number on the scoreboard. Junior redshirt goalie Charlie Pruitt makes some strong saves to keep the Lions in the game, but the Gauchos keep their tough play up. I'm playing for 28 other girls, and I have to make sure that I can handle the pressure and handle everything in goal and stuff, and just making sure, and like just reminding myself, like, I have other people that count on me to be successful, so I need to make sure that I'm like consistently successful as well. In the 43rd minute of play, the Lions get ready to defend a corner kick. With the game on the line once again, there is no room for mistakes. After scrambling around the box, a gaucho player heads the ball past Pruitt and into the net. The Lions head into halftime down 1-0. I think honestly there's just like key players on the team that kind of know their role as people that bring like a good solid energy and like like Serena and like other people that just like never really let that down. Like they they can like tell if something's down or we need some extra push of energy. Like there are people that like their personality just automatically brings that to the team. I usually just try and remind people how great they are. That's like my like I just try and like make people think that they're really awesome when they don't feel that awesome. That's like my biggest thing. Like, we just have such a good bond and like we really are each other's best friends and teammates. It makes it so easy to like work with each other and like work for each other. 